Russian sprinter Kristina Timonoska currently seeking asylum in Poland. Officials are calling on Belarus to respond to the allegations that Belarusian officials tried to force her onto a flight back to Minsk because of her criticism of the country's Olympic trainers on social media. Here's more from the International Olympic Committee. I think the IOC acted very quickly in terms of the first um, first issue for us, which was the um, the well-being of the athlete involved. We were in touch with her within uh, hours at the airport on the evening, so we, we made sure of that. We spoke to her again the next day, and we were working with other partners, including UNHCR, to make sure she was safe. Uh, as regards the process, there has to be a process because there's all sorts of allegations swirling around, and we have to hear what they are. In the meantime, as we laid out yesterday, there are very, very extensive um, abilities to talk to athletes at the village.